Tyler, do you know what it means to break bread? Or as other people call it, having communion? Yes, that means having juice and bread at church. And I love juice and bread. But do you know why we do it? Like what it actually means? Um, not really. Maybe I need a reminder. Breaking bread helps us to remember Jesus. For us to remember what it was like before Jesus came. For what Jesus did for us. And to remember what we have done. How does drinking juice and eating bread remind us of all of that? Before Jesus died, he shared a meal with his disciples. And he explained to them, with the bread and the wine, how he would die. Jesus said that his body would be broken, just like the bread would be broken. And that the wine being poured out would be like his blood being spilt. Jesus told us to use the bread and the wine to help us remember, and that we must do it often. So by doing what the disciples did, we are remembering what Jesus did? Yes, Jesus was the perfect sacrifice. And breaking bread helps us to remember for us to be thankful and to celebrate what Jesus did for us, which was dying on the cross to pay the price of our sins. And we need to remember that our sin is serious and it separates us from God. And the price to pay for sin is death. God's love and forgiveness is undeserved. That's why he sent his son Jesus to die in our place and take our punishment so that we can be forgiven, and so that we can be in God's presence one day in heaven and here on earth. Yes, breaking bread also helps us to remember that we've been made one in Jesus Christ, and that means we are forgiven. That means that we are now part of God's church, part of his family, part of his body, and that the Holy Spirit comes to guide and help us. Breaking bread also helps us to remember that Jesus is coming back, that we will be able to spend eternity with God in heaven. Wow. So breaking bread is not only for special meetings or for Sunday services, but you can do it anywhere? Yes, we can break bread anywhere, as it's an act of remembrance for us. So we can remember to be thankful to Jesus for what he did for us, how we have all sinned, and how God's love is undeserved, how Jesus has made us one with him, and that Jesus is coming back and we will get to spend eternity with God in heaven. Wow, that's amazing. I can't wait to remember how Jesus told us to, by breaking bread. Why don't you break bread with your family and remember what Jesus has done?